All right, my friends, the countdown is on. In 48 hours, thousands of people will be in downtown Columbia to celebrate the Gamecocks' third national championship. And this morning, we want to bring you all the details for the big victory parade, starting with the route. Now, the festivities will kick off at 2 o'clock Sunday afternoon in the 1700 block of Main Street, which is the corner of Main and Laurel Streets. Now the parade will go all the way down Main Street and end at the State House. And that is where we will hear from Coach Staley, players and other dignitaries. And when it comes to who's going to be in this parade, not only will we get to see the team, but we'll also hear from local elected officials. We'll hear from community partners and we'll hear from city council members as well as USC officials. And before you head to the parade, you'll want to plan ahead because for some, the big question is going to be, well, how do I get there and then where can I park? So let's go ahead and break down the road closures about what you can expect for your Sunday afternoon commute. So first up, these road closures are going to be separated into three phases. The first one is going to begin at noon. These are the ones right here on your screen. They include parts of Calhoun, Richland, Laurel, Maine, and Gervais Street. And then happening just a half an hour after that at 1230, we have a couple of ones. Finally, 1 p.m. over there. This is the 1231 Sumter Street, Senate Street, and Marion Street. Then at 1 o'clock, this is going to be the biggest one there from the 1200 to the 1700 block of Main Street, all before the parade begins at 2. The roads will reopen once the parade is over. And if you are looking for parking, here's some good news. The downtown city parking garages will be free for this parade. And it is important to note that there will be no parking after 12 midnight on Sunday in that parade route and towing will be enforced. And a quick reminder, the city will be bagging those meters starting at 8 p.m. on Saturday. However, enforcement for those won't begin until midnight on Sunday. And ADA parking will be available at 1420 Assembly Street surface lot on a first come first serve basis. And you're talking about temperatures that are going to be looking pretty good around 1 o'clock, around 80 degrees. So it's going to be pretty warm. And then as we go into 2 o'clock when the actual parade starts, around 82 degrees, 83 by 3 o'clock. And we do expect daytime highs of about 84 on Sunday. We'll add a few clouds out there, but still mainly sunny skies for your Sunday afternoon. So the weather should cooperate 100%. And as we've been talking about all morning long, it looks like it's going to be even warmer as we go into the beginning of the next work week. But we'll break down that forecast much further and have your seven day and one more look at traffic coming up in just a few minutes. And a friendly reminder, my friends, WLTX is your place to watch the Gamecocks Championship Parade. Now, coverage begins at 2 o'clock Sunday afternoon. We'll have streaming online and on all our digital services. That includes WLTX.com, our News 19 app, and the WLTX YouTube page. And, of course, you can watch it on your TV on the free WLTX Plus streaming app, which you can download on Roku, Amazon Fire, and Apple TV.